In this video, we will talk about 7 reasons you should not get a female blue healer. The Australian cattle dog, commonly known as the blue healer, is a distinctive breed, revered for its intelligence, athleticism, and unwavering devotion. Distinguished by their unique coats and sharp minds, these dogs are also known for their seemingly limitless reservoirs of energy, making them an attractive choice for prospective pet owners who lead active lifestyles. However, owning a female blue healer is not for everyone. Despite their many admirable qualities, there are some unique challenges associated with this breed that might make them unsuitable for certain lifestyles and households. Here are seven reasons why you might want to reconsider adopting a female blue healer. Number 1. High Energy Levels Perhaps the most notable characteristic of the blue healer is their intense energy level. Historically bred for herding cattle across the sprawling Australian outback, these dogs are hardy, resilient, and require substantial daily physical activity. If their exercise needs are not met, they can become restless, anxious, and potentially destructive. The energy needs of a blue healer are not comparable to those of more sedentary breeds. A walk around the block will not suffice. They need space and opportunity to run, play, and burn off their high energy. Failure to provide this can lead to behavioral issues that are challenging to manage, particularly in a home environment. Number 2. Need for Mental Stimulation Along with their physical vitality, blue healers are endowed with exceptional intelligence. Consequently, they require consistent mental stimulation. They thrive on problem-solving activities and games that challenge their intellect. Without it, these smart canines can become bored and resort to problematic behaviors, such as excessive barking, digging, or even destructive chewing. For busy households or individuals looking for a more low-maintenance pet, the blue healer's need for constant mental engagement can quickly become overwhelming. Interactive toys, puzzle games, and regular training sessions are all essential components of owning a happy and healthy blue healer. Number 3. Strong Herding Instinct Another characteristic that sets blue healers apart is their deeply rooted herding instinct. While this makes them excellent working dogs, it can pose challenges in a domestic setting. This behavior might extend to hurting other pets, children, or even adults in the household, leading to nipping or other potentially problematic behaviors. This behavior can be troublesome, especially in a household with small children or other pets. Number 4. Potential for Dominance A trait not unique to, but often observed in the female blue healer is a tendency towards dominance if they are not appropriately trained and socialized. These dogs are naturally assertive and can become overbearing or territorial without a confident leader guiding their behaviors. This trait requires an owner with experience in handling dogs and establishing a clear hierarchy within the home. Number 5. Need for Extensive Socialization Blue healers are known to be somewhat reserved or wary around strangers. Without extensive and ongoing socialization from a young age, this wariness can potentially escalate into protective or aggressive behaviors. This trait means that owners need to invest a considerable amount of time and effort into socializing their dog. This process isn't just about exposing the dog to a variety of people and animals, but also a range of different environments and situations to ensure they are comfortable and confident. Number 6. Health Issues Despite being generally robust dogs, blue healers can be predisposed to certain health conditions. These include progressive retinal atrophy PRA, hip dysplasia, and in some cases, deafness. Prospective owners need to consider the potential for high vet bills and the responsibility that comes with caring for a dog that may develop health problems. Regular checkups, a nutritious diet, and adequate exercise are all crucial in maintaining the health of these dogs. Number 7. Not ideal for apartment living. Due to their active nature and requirement for space, blue healers are not ideally suited to apartment living. These dogs thrive in environments where they have plenty of room to move around, run, and play. A cramped apartment can lead to frustration, anxiety, and subsequent destructive behaviors. While there are valid considerations and potential challenges associated with adopting a female blue healer, it's crucial to remember that with the right training, socialization, and living conditions, many of these issues can be adequately managed. Their loyalty, intelligence, and boundless energy make them wonderful companions for the right owner. However, owning a blue healer is a commitment, 
one that requires meeting their physical, mental, and social needs. Before you decide to adopt a blue healer or any dog for that matter, always consider your lifestyle, living situation, and the breed's characteristics and needs. Remember that owning a pet is a lifelong commitment, and the goal is to create a happy, healthy relationship between pet and owner. This can only be achieved if the match is right for both parties. The Blue Healer is a breed that can bring immense joy, love, and activity into your life, but it's important to ensure you are equally capable of providing a suitable home for them. That's it for today. Hope you found this video informative. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching.